just a way of expressing yourself, you know, against the rules. You're not allowed to write on the wall, right? Everyone writes on the wall when they're a little kid, get in trouble. Some people just keep doing it. I used to sneak out. That was the thing to do. Sneak out of my parents' house. Just spend all night out for me. Come home with the blowing your nose and it was like rainbow colored, you know? It was a good way to get all my angry feelings out. I feel like if I get pissed off about something, I'll go out and do a bunch of pieces and throw up or whatever, but like if I'm real pumped up about something, I'll go do it too. It's just an emotional outlet a lot of the time. What makes graffiti fun is getting, like, getting over, getting over on people, like, getting your name up without people knowing, and then the next morning them being like, oh shit, they got over on us, like, they did a fill in on our, on like our shitty dilapidated fence. Uh, I've overheard people talking about Remio, like, it's just funny, me sitting there and listening to them talk about me, but they're talking about, like, this like made up person that they like they just see my graffiti and they, they make up like a personality to go along with it. I like seeing where there's uh, kind of a risk involved, that's always fun. Risk is fun. Even if you do get locked up or whatever, you get caught, it's kind of just like part of your life. It's hard to understand the compulsion to write on stuff, you know? It's all part of who I am. Writing graffiti, it's, it's like I am definitely Remio. I don't have two identities, it's just I got two names. One I write on walls and one I write on my chest, you know?